Hey guys, welcome to today's video! Today, I will be doing my makeup. And the reason I decided to make this video is because I have a bunch of new products that I want to try out. I got a package from the company by Terry. Their logo oh, looks like that. By Terry. And I want to try out some of the awesome stuff I got. Uh, so, kind of sponsored video, but then again they didn't ask me to make the video, so... Just so you know what's going on. Um, as for By Terry being cruelty free, some sources say they are, some sources say they sell in China, so I'm not gonna guarantee anything in this video. Sorry about the background in this video, I know it's uh, less than perfect, but that's life. I think the first product I'm gonna be using is this uh, Cellularose, Cellularose Brightening CC Serum Color Control Radiance Elixir So this look is gonna be super glowy because I got a lot of glowy products and I want to try all of them So this is kind of a light diffuser youth enhancer Yes? I don't know how much to use Two pumps maybe? No, I think that's way too much Well, that sure is glowy. I don't know if you guys can see, but my face is glowing. We'll see how much this shows through my powder foundation, but uh, hopefully it gives a little bit of a glow to it. Okay, now I don't even know what products I have. What goes on next? Um, I have a kind of glow duo stick. So this is what the glow duo stick looks like. So it's kind of white and pink, but it comes off mainly glowy, so it's not really like a blush. Um, Two-tone face sculpting. Well, let's just... Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna be glowing so much from all this stuff. And a little bit there. So there. I don't really have my beauty blender here, so we're going old school with the fingers. <laughs> oh, I need to remove my nail polish before I leave because I am going to Iceland tomorrow. Or actually I'm leaving today to go to Stockholm and then tomorrow early in the morning we're going to Iceland. Super glowy, my lord. Um, I'm gonna do a quick little nose contour before I go in with my foundation since my contouring kit from Anastasia is cream, so we don't want to do that last. So some of these products, I'm not sure which product it is, but it has a very fragrant smell. It's that, can you say that? It's very fragrant. It doesn't smell bad. It smells a little bit like sunscreen, although I don't think there's any SPF in it. So there, nose contour done. Now let's do... I mean, I have a few powder products, I guess. I got this product, which is Compact Expert Duo Powder in Beige Nude. But I think this would be a little bit too dark to go all over my face. Um, Let's see, can you see that? It swatches like, yeah, I don't know, beige. I also got this Hyaluronic Hydra Powder. Colorless Hydra Care Powder. So maybe I can use this under my, over my foundation. <laughs> I haven't done any concealing, maybe I should do that. Not that I'm big on concealer, but Every now and then, why not? Oh, I actually got a concealing stick. Maybe we should try that. I forgot. But that one was quite um, warm toned. You kind of click it up, which is kind of inconvenient, but... I 
guess. <laughs> I hate my winter hair color. It's so ugly. Ugh. It looks like crap. But in the summer, when the sun is on it, it becomes a nice color. So I guess I just have to suffer through it. Now let's just go in with a damn foundation powder. Uh, Bare Minerals, as always. Can't say I see much of the glow through that, but... Uh, Oh well. I have some more glow to pop on top later, so I'm sure it will be fine. I got this uh, palette called Sun Design Palette 5 Hippie Chic. And it looks like this. So I think it's uh, like a blush, bronze, and highlight palette. Um, the thing is, I also got a blush. I'll show you the blush. The blush looks like this, which is really, really nice. So I'm not really sure what I want to do with blush. I would like to try this one. Eh, maybe I use both. Let's start with this big palette thingy. Mixing everything. I mean, it's difficult to bronze with such a pink product. Because, I mean, only the middle one here is kind of brownish. But even that is a little bit too pink to be called a bronzer, I would say. But it looks nice. I'll do some more contouring-ish uh, with my Bahama Mama. Bronzer. I have like a really weird crease around my nose. Like, how does it even crease there? <laughs> I don't even, there's no face movement I do that could cause creasing there, but oh well. Eyebrows, maybe? Wait, what is it now? Monday? Yeah, before the weekend anyway. I stretched my septum again, or it wasn't much of a stretch because I previously had a 10 gauge in my nose and I this is a 8 gauge and it just went in by itself after my 10 gauge healed, uh, which basically just means that my nose remembers <laughs> uh, this size from when it used to be this size, like a year ago. So, because this was the piece of jewelry I wanted to get back. Um, and now I have it again. So now my nose ring is a an 8G, which I think is like 3.2 millimeters. And the diameter, I'm not sure. Maybe like 10, no, not 10, probably like 11 or 12 millimeters. Something like that. Easy brows, just like that. Um, for those of you who don't know yet what I'm doing in Iceland, where is my brow gel? Um, I am actually going there for a photo shoot, which is so awesome. The backstory to this like photo shoot thingy is that when I graduated high school um, in 2012, so five years ago. Six years ago? Six years ago this summer. Um, I got this uh, necklace that you guys have seen in every single video I ever made. Um, I got this necklace from a family friend, or my mom's best friend, and I have been wearing it since. Um, and a lot of you always ask, like, what does your necklace mean? Is it a death wish necklace? Is it this necklace? Is it that necklace? But no, 
This is an Icelandic rune that means good luck. Um, because our family friends had been to Iceland and they got this for me. Completely random. Um, and then I made the video on the necklace and, well, maybe it wasn't exactly from that video, but one of my viewers went to the company, Alrun Nordic Jewelry. They went to their shop in Iceland, in Reykjavik. And they said that they kind of found the company from me or they showed them my video or something like that. And the company contacted me. And first they were like, hey, we just wanted to say thank you for making the video, for wearing our jewelry. And uh, like send me a Christmas gift. So I got that amazing blanket from them, the wool blanket that's in our couch, um, which is the best blanket I've owned in my life. It's amazing. And then later we started discussing like a collaboration or a sponsorship or they kind of want me to be an ambassador for their brand, which is amazing. So I'm super duper excited about that. They wanted me to come to Iceland to do a photo shoot, which is like... And I mean, it's just a dream come true to just go to Iceland, but to go there and do a photo shoot is like even better. Now I'm just using my Idun eyeshadow palette. That's way too big for its own good. Uh, and I'm just gonna do very little eye contouring. <laughs> So my mom is coming along to Iceland as well, so you will see her in my vlogs and she will help me to film like behind the scenes footage of photo shoots and all of that stuff that we're doing. So that's gonna be cool. And then, I mean, the photo shoot is gonna be two days and then we're gonna travel around a little bit for the other two days that we're gonna be there. And I'm gonna vlog as much as possible for you guys. I don't think I'm doing any eyeliner, I'm just gonna do some mascara. But first, let's try this blush as well. Everything smells so good. Even though I'm not a fan of fragrant makeup, it smells good. <laughs> Let's do some mascara, a little bit of lips, and then we're done. <laughs> Whoa! All time favorite mascara of my life, the Yedun Air. Air. but not least lips and I have two new lip products I think yes by bye bye Terry <laughs> um, this one is a contour and volume plump and contour red and wine uh, which looks like this so it's two colored one a little bit darker red and one lighter red but I'm not feeling red lips today so I'm gonna I think I'm gonna use this one which is like a mauve ish shade. Let's see. It looks like this. So I'm going to use my favorite. It's getting really small, but I have a backup. Uh, Fairy Tale Dream by Makeup Store, which I have been using for years and years and years. I'm not gonna fill it in the whole way. Um, I'm just gonna use this instead. And just dab it on.
it's not as dark as it looks in the camera it doesn't really do it justice i think that's all i'm doing today i'm gonna straighten my hair a little bit as well because it has some weird waves in it for some reason <laughs> hope you guys have liked this little makeup video I mean, it's the same look that I always do, but it was a few new products that I liked. So until the next video, which is definitely going to be an Iceland vlog, I will see you later. I uh, hope you have a good one. See you later. Goodbye!